Hi, I'm Brittany with Candy Systems, and today I'm going to be making one of Candy's latest products, which is our key fob. It's a wristband, and it has a little piece for you to hang your keys off of. So we're going to get started making this today. First, you'll need your key fob, the image you like to display. We're going to be doing each side separately, so I have two different images uh, aligned like this. We do have other pressing methods, so make sure you follow your printing instructions correctly. Print those out correct. I have a pair of scissors for separating my transfer, heat tape, several pieces of protective paper, and a sticky lint roller. What we're going to do first is pre-press our wristband for 10 seconds at 400 degrees, medium pressure. And then while it's still warm, we're going to grab our lint roller and we'll sticky lint roll it while it's still warm. Once your 10 seconds is up, quickly remove this from our heat press. I find it's easiest to get off all the lint while my substrate is still warm. Now we're ready to apply our image, so just real quick. Separate my two images. You can do heat tape or pro spray, either one. You'll probably want to do pro spray if you're going to do mass production. But for our project, since we're just doing a single piece and we're pressing each side separately, we can do the heat tape. Go to my press sheet of protective paper. My image is going to be facing down. Another sheet of protective paper on the top. I have 400 degrees, medium pressure, and we're going to keep it there for 45 seconds. And that sound means we're done. So I'm going to lift and swing away on my press. Move my top sheet of protective paper. And that's just the first half of our wristband. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. We just finished the other side of our wristband. And this is the newest product, the key fob again. And it has a little place for you to hang your keys, make it very convenient for you to wear and carry your keys at the same time. We're going to be doing another video in the future, so you'll want to tune in and check it out because we have a different method of pressing these when you want to do a large quantity. We'll be either using one of our aluminum blanks or doing a water bottle where you can do it in a mug press and it's real neat, you can line them up. And you'll want to be sure to pay attention to how you print out those templates because it's a little bit different depending on how you press them. Be sure to check out our website at condi.com for all of our products and services and watch more of my videos at condi.tv.com. I'm Brittany with Condi Systems and thank you for joining us.